You have recently been very critical of the Public Service Commission and how it does its business, and you've been very concerned about rate increases yes. for some of the utilities that are asking for it. Can you tell us what your greatest concerns are and how you're trying to address them? Accountability and transparency. We have now found that the Public Service Commission has been, for many years, having a cozy relationship with electric companies, water companies that come before them and that, that they regulate. Uh, we need to stop that. Uh, we need to look at major changes with the Public Service Commission. In fact, we might even ask the voters uh, through a referendum on the 2010 ballot whether they'd like to go back to a elected uh, Public Service Commission, which we had many years ago, versus a an appointed one, allow the voters to make that decision. But in the meantime, I think the legislature has a responsibility to look at the entire Public Service Commission and make major changes, making sure that the cozy relationship not only the Public Service Commission members have with utility companies, but also their staff, that all has to stop. Do you think that there will be comprehensive reform legislation? Oh, I coming do. out of the legislature in the 2010 session? I do. I think because of uh, the outcry by my constituents, constituents around the state, the consumers, the ratepayers, I think my colleagues have heard them loud and clear, and I believe that we're going to see some comprehensive changes made to the Public Service Commission. You know, in 1993, a grand jury made some very good uh, suggestions about making changes to the Public Service Commission. They were totally ignored. We'll be filing legislation, I will be filing legislation that takes the 1993 recommendations from the grand jury and puts them into statute. I'm hoping my colleagues will support me.